Hi, Kiana with PMP Crafters, and today we are going to be making a chip bag template using Microsoft Word. So the first thing you're going to need to do is open Microsoft Word and create a new document. Once that document is up, you will have your standard 11 by 8.5 sheet of paper here in front of you. First thing we want to do is we want to go to our layout and we are going to change our uh, margins to a 0.5 top, 0.5 bottom. Then we're going to change to landscape. And this is what our chip bag would look like. And then we want to make sure that our size paper is of course the 8.5 by 11. Once we have all of that, we're going to go to insert. From here, we're going to insert the center shape of our chip bag, which is going to be a rectangle shape. From there, what we're going to do is just simply draw a rectangle just for our rectangle toolbar to come up. Over here to the right side, we have our height and our, our width here. And what we're going to do for our height, our height, oh, sorry, our height of our chip bag, we're going to delete that and we're going to type in 6.44 inches high. And then for our width here, we're going to type in. 5.45 then click enter okay once we have that we're just going to move it to the center of our bag here all right now that is going to be our center now we need to do our sides so what we're going to do go back we're going to do another shape here. We're going to draw another box. We're going to go back to our height. Height is still going to be 6.44. And our width is going to be 2.52. And click enter. Now I'm going to change the color of this just so we'll be able to tell our sides from our center. Okay, now we have one side, center, and we need to make our other side. Okay, what I like to do is to right click, copy, then move over here and paste. Okay, sometimes your computer will do this and you want to make sure that it is on top of all layers there and then you're able to move it over. Okay, once we have that, I want to go to view and we're going to view our ruler. And the ruler is going to help us get this all centered here. Once we have it all centered and lined up, we are done. So once you have this here, you're able to then create what you would like for your chip bag. This will be the center of your chip bag, so you will put all of your designs in here. Then you have your left and your right for the back of your chip bag, and it's all done. Of course, when this prints out, it's going to leave your white areas. And what I like to do, so this is just not all plain white, I will put a design here, and then, of course, when your printer gets ready to print it out, it will leave those margins. 
And so wherever your design is not will be white. And then the remainder will be whatever colors or designs you decided to put on there. I hope this video was informative. This tutorial helped you out. If it did, give it a big thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe and hit that notification bell so you won't miss out on any of the future videos we have for you. Thank you. Have a good day.